Well, the French Open gets underway on Sunday, and of course we have great opportunity with a couple of our young guns on the men's side. Uh, Bernard Tomek, Thanasi Kokonakis, and Nick Kyrgios, all with really good chances of going deep. Nick Kyrgios comes in as confident as he's ever been in his career with a win over Roger Federer in Madrid. It's given him the belief that he can perform well and beat the big guns on clay. He's seeded for the first time in a slam, an excellent result. A tough ask for Bernard Tomic on the clay at Roland Garros. It's, it's his least favourite surface. Um, but, you know, he can perform well out there if he uses the court to his advantage. Fanasi Kokonakis gets in on a wild card. The good news is he's cracked the top 100, doesn't need that for the rest of the slams this year. So that's great news. His form has been excellent, won more matches basically than anyone on tour because of all the qualifying he's had to do. So he's confident, he's a good clay quarter, and uh, I think that Fanasi can have an excellent French. Best move that Sam Stoza made going into the French was to get Dave Taylor back on board gives her some, some calm confidence because she goes back to something she knows well. We've already seen some results to indicate that. If the draw is kind to her, she definitely can be in a quarter or semi this year at the French. For Casey Delacqua on the clay, it's all about striking the ball well, which she does nine out of 10 days. She always hits the ball well. One thing I look out for with Casey, she, she comes in with excellent doubles form. She's a former mixed champion, and I wouldn't be surprised that she maybe takes home a slam title in the doubles. Daria Gavrilova, representing Australia in Paris, been working here at the National Academy for a couple of years. What a year she's had. She beat Maria Sharapova. Semis in Rome, which is a fantastic performance. She's broken into the world's top 50. And with the confidence and match play that she's had this year, there is absolutely no reason why we couldn't see her sneak into a fourth round or a quarter final. Well, there's a couple of players that I haven't mentioned that, that I think are worthy of that. Sam Groth comes into the French. If he can play aggressive, sneak into the net, hold serve, he can do some real damage. And another player for me who's had a very good season, who has the potential to go to the fourth round or quarters, is Yamila Gaidasova. Well, it's going to be a really exciting French. I mean, the fact that there are six men in the main draw, the first time for about 15 years, and you put Sam, Casey, Yamila and Daria into that equation as well, we've got some great viewing over the next two and a half weeks. Thank you.